What's going on, everybody? How you doing? We are live right here at the Americana in Glendale at Top Shop, and we got a special guest actually just popped up on us and everything. I popped up all right. <laughs> this is the Americana, but United States, the Britannia. <laughs> Do you all know who that is? I don't know who I am, you know, so if you know, keep it to yourself. <laughs> it's Austin. Hello. What's your name, baby? My name is Paz. Your name is Paz. Paz, like yeah. the thing that you open yeah. it up and pull it out? It's a Paz, P-A-Z. Paz, P-A-Z. It sounds dirty, and I like Thank it. Thank you. Thank you very much. Do you mind if I make a Paz at you, Paz? <laughs> <laughs> I love it, I love it, I love it. Uh, What's going on, buddy? What's your name? Dan. We're Dan. opening up a nightclub. It's uh, called the Electric Pussycat, and okay. it's open tonight. 10 o'clock till 2. The Electric Pussycat. Electric Pussycat, yep. Right. Have some Pussycats open there? We do. Yeah. All right, yeah. definitely. Yeah. Oh, y'all got yeah. Mini Me with you. Yeah. What up, man? Mini Me, we got to bring them over here. Definitely, definitely. Well, we would definitely be tagging along at the Electric Pussycat and everything. Um, we're here shooting for my guy, John Baptiste, for their little pop-up here at the Top Shop and everything, man. So, definitely. All right. Def nice. Thank you. Nice Thank meeting you. you. Yes, you. yes, sir. Look at all these beautiful ladies. What's your name, love? Foxy, nice. Pleasure, Would you mind pleasure. telling us what you girls are up to? Oh, girl, I wish I could get into detail, but it's shenanigans. All right, all right, all right. I love your pink. What's your name? Fimba. Fimba, pleasure to meet you. Wait, wait a second, wait a second. Let's make some All right. We don't talk much. I he just says a thousand words, baby. <laughs> it's mini me. Hello, mini me. How are you? He bites, but that's all right, you know. <laughs> all right, love, yeah, okay. You know where we are now, right? Austin, we're going to party with you a little later on tonight. I want you to yeah. All right, you bring Where's the pussy cats, gonna... we'll bring yes, something. I'll bring the cat. <laughs> You'll bring the cat. Somebody's called. Oh, it's the famous Shannon Fuller is calling, the Playgirl Man of the Year. Hello, Shannon. We're on live here in Glendale, baby. <laughs> all right, all right. So listen. We're about to go in and check out my man John and everything and um, see what he's got going on. We're here at the Top Shop in Americana and uh, we're bringing this here. You are live with Conversations with Manny J. I'm your host, Manny J. Style. And this is Paz Eliza. What's going on, everybody? I am your host. Manny J style. We're here at Conversations with Manny J. We're here live at Top Shop. I got my man John, the Baptiste in the building. Yes. Yo, Jay, what's up? Hey, what's going doing? on, man? Long time see. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And this Hi. is Paz. Nice to you? meet you. So, so, dog, I'm proud of you, man. Yeah, Just man. all the moves you making, man. It's been a long time coming. Yo, yeah. let me tell you, dog. I gotta keep it 100 with you. I listened to your YouTube channel about three weeks ago. The, uh, the, uh, which one? The, I put it like this. The one where you said, just do it. You gotta just do it, bro. Right? No excuses. No excuses. Your dreams, your aspirations. You're the only one can control it, right? Right. Just do it. Yeah. So, you know what was really crazy, man, is that, um, I really had this idea for this podcast. Yeah. And I think I talked to you about it last year. Mm -hmm. And, um, I really didn't know how I was gonna do it. Yeah. But we you started. But we started, yeah. we started it, and uh, we've already shot our first couple episodes, and you in that mix, man. But I just wanted yeah. to tell you, man, that's why it's important for us to, like, put our message out there. That's why you got to have your YouTube channel and yeah. cook and style yeah. and do everything yeah. and not limit yourself. Right. And um, and I just wanted to let you know that that message that I heard that day, literally, I called her, like, five minutes later and was like, yo, we going to do this. You know what? You know what? Listen, the reason I do it because one person is going to hear it. Now, I don't care about the numbers. One person is going to hear what I got to say. And that's why I push it out every Monday. It's a motivation for Mondays. 
whatever you need to do, whatever's in your mind, aspiration, whatever it is, we're gonna go for it. We're gonna do it. You know what I'm saying? And that's why I push it out to be, to inspire other people. That's the thing. That's yeah. what we want to do, right? Yeah. yeah. That's the goal. Yeah. That's the goal for all this. And it's not about just talking. It's about doing. You know right. what I mean? That's one thing that I just hold kind of for myself, man. I'm a, I'm someone that like to take action. If I say, yo, let's get up and do some shit, let's do it. we gonna get up and do some. Absolutely. So, Absolutely. yo, I just want to ask you one question, dude. My first question is, what was the biggest challenge that you faced today? Wow. Wow. Good one. Yeah. Biggest challenge I had today. Um, waking up with a positive mind. Waking up with a positive mind. Sometimes we get into a rut. You know, we wake up and, you know, it's like, okay, we have these problems, these issues or whatever. But turning that around and being positive every step of today is the biggest thing for me. Okay. That's that's what helped me. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Get through the day, for real. Even so, up to this point. Up to right this now. Because we all go through life. Right. 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 We all got problems. We all right. got issues that we deal with on a daily day basis. Right. But... You gotta remember to be positive and know everything's gonna be okay. You know what I'm saying? So right. that's 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 my thing today. You know, man, this whole entire podcast is about fashion, yeah. art, philanthropy, and influence. And um, you know, right here we're 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 at fashion. We're in fashion right yeah. now. That's what we do. Yeah. But more than anything, you know, you got a big following on Instagram, but it's not about the following that you have. It's about the influence and the impact that you have on society and the world. And what I want people to understand is how to use their creativity and their their purpose to influence the world. Yeah. Not your following on Instagram. Because you can have a lot of followers. You got, well, how many followers you got? Uh, about 50K. 50K. You got 50K people here today? Nah. But the people that's here that you've influenced... They're here, and they're yeah. here to support you Absolutely. and, that's, and everything. That's, that's all that matters. That's it. If I can get one person to listen to what I'm doing, that's what matters. That's, that's, what, that's what I'm saying. That's exactly what that's matters. That's all that matters. I, if I can't touch 50,000 people, guess what? I know I can touch one person. That's it. And, yep. that, one and person. that one person can touch another person. Exactly. And that's, like, basically the effect that you're going to get. Absolutely. Absolutely. Right there. Right there. So, pause. Tell Paz, um, John, tell Paz a little bit about this pop-up and what you got going on. Yeah. So, Paz, I, I started um, as a uh, fashion blogger, and uh, one of my friends who is doing great stuff with Topshop brought me on board with Topshop. Um, an amazing brand, um, especially for, like, Coachella this summer, everything being festive type of look. Um, we're doing a ho we're hosting right now, and we're doing 15% off, 20% off of everything in the store. And it's come in, have fun with us, have drinks, you know. And let's 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 talk. Let's yeah. talk. You know what I'm saying? That's yeah. why y'all here, right? Right. Yeah. You know, that's so that's what we're here for. That's what we're here for. Definitely. Yeah. And who and who are you hosting it with? I know you're hosting it with someone I'm else. I'm with Coco. She's coming out right now. But I'm hosting it with Coco, um, Janelle, and she's an amazing person. She has a great following. Okay. But she's she's doing the exact same thing that I'm doing. Okay. We're both hitting and inspiring people that we need to inspire. So look, let me ask you a question. So for our viewers, because we have, a, this is also, we're, we're filming also, but we also have the podcast. So people may not be able to actually see this. So this is kind of a treat for them. Um, tell the people what you got going on, man, and what you're doing. Okay. Say one more time. Sorry. So, no, no, no problem. Um, tell the people what you got going on and, and exactly what John the Baptiste says, the brand. Tell them what you got going on so and what you're John doing. John the Baptiste is myself, and it's a brand. I cook. I'm in fashion, I do everything lifestyle, um, hotel collabs, everything. I, it's just me. It's, it's me putting myself out into the world and not being ashamed about what I do. You okay. feel what I'm saying? That's me, John the Baptist. Now. Hey, that makes a lot of good sense. I, yeah, yeah. I mean, that's just me. With positivity that's and it. spreading the word. You know, you know, honestly, I just started getting into that like realm of, like, I need to motivate people. Like, in the past, like, hmm. Three months, right. honestly, because right. there's a purpose. Right. I have a purpose. I have a purpose to inspire people. Right. So right. that's why you see the YouTube channel. Right. And you see, like, uh, me cooking food. I cook food. And he's you know, a good cook. I, you know, I do my thing. I do my <laughs> thing. But, you know, I do all that stuff. But it's always to inspire people. Always to inspire people. So another thing that, that really, really struck me about the whole entire movement that you have been making and just you know just the type of person you are and everything is we got a mutual friend in common yes sir you know what i'm yeah. saying so kind of tell friend. your my best your friend, friend. Yeah. yeah and a great friend of mine is exactly how i know you and everything yeah. but just kind of tell the people where that 
where that actually started from in that relationship as yeah, well. So, like, me and my best friend, we started, we, we were in college together, and we had this company called Dapper Young Gentlemen, uh, accessory brand that we had. Um, we moved out to L.A., and my best friend ended up connecting with you and, and then connecting all three of us because he does his thing, too, in the fashion world as well, as y'all can see. Try, try. You're the best looking dude out here right now. Look at him, look at him, look at him, look at him. Look I at try, him. I try. But, you know, connecting, and that's Thank what you. it's about. You know, we all networked and we all became good friends, and, you know, we're trying to move up together and do our thing and just inspire everybody. Yeah. That's, and that's that's how it came about. Yeah. And yeah. we've known each other how long? Like three? Four uh, years? Probably, five, four, years? Five, five years? Five years, yeah. Yo, I've been five out years. in LA for seven years. Yep. So, yep. At, least, at least five of those yep. seven. And when I was in New York, you know what I'm saying, Steve? Like, always he, had you. He touched, he, he reached yeah. out, came to my pop-up yeah. and everything. Yo, so I'm going to ask you one question, man. If you could leave, since you're, you know, into motivating and inspiring people and everything, there's two things. Like I said, our whole entire podcast, this whole entire movement is about influence mm -hmm. and using your influence to impact the world and, you know, your creativity or whatever. But what is one, like, philanthropic thing that you feel that you could actually do or uh, organization that you would like to partner up with to, like, to utilize that? Ooh, good one. Um, I would say the ooh, Black Lives Matter movement. Okay. That That's my thing. These are my people. Okay. Um, you know, sometimes where we, we get down because of things that have happened to us in the past, but as people where we're at right now, at the level that we're at right now, I think we need to show example okay. of where you can go because okay. I've come from nothing. Okay. So I'm here coming from nothing. So I could show you exactly okay. where I came from, okay. but also being aware of things that's happening in society and letting people know that black lives do matter. And, you know and how would you want to be a part of that and that type of movement and that initiative? You know what? Honestly, um, I have a podcast as well. Okay. And I spoke about this on a podcast. Like You can't expect people to speak for you okay. and have a voice for you until you start having a voice for yourself. Okay. So if I have to get out there and march with everybody, if I have to be a part of every single movement about Black Lives Matter, then that's what I got to do. And that's how I'll be a part. Okay. Yeah. You know, one thing that really stuck out about what you just said is, is, is getting where you came from versus versus where you're going and where you're headed. But you had to make a decision. You had to make a choice. Every, everything starts with a choice. And just as being a young black man myself and, you know, raising a young black man, one thing that I, I realized in our, in our own men, in our culture, is that we have to show people what their options are and what their choices are. And one way we do that, you're a cool guy. And so I'm pretty sure a lot of uh, young guys, a lot of young people look up to you. And so, man, one thing that I would love for you to, you know, bring you on, man, I would love to even kind of be a challenge in a sense, but I'd love for you to come down and get involved with us at, here at, at our nonprofit, Hope Healing, man, and come out. You know, we do a style makeover for the kids, but more than anything, it's about that actual connection. So, man, I love you. If you got a weekend or got some time, man, you got some clothes you want to donate, more than just donating the clothes, but come on and connect with some of the young folks that, we, that we're that we working with, man. And yeah. we got a couple of events going on, I can tell, tell you about it a little later. But, yo, I would love to have your energy there because that presence and that voice is what people need to hear, and especially this generation to come. You know what I'm saying? And one thing that you have is a fashion platform, and by you having a platform in fashion and anything else that you're doing, people respect that because they're like, damn, this dude fly. You know what I mean? Yeah. And that's just... This is how we look, you know what I'm saying? But we're way more inside, right. you know right. what I'm saying? So, look, we're going to get in here and go check out the rest of this, yes, this pop-up and there. check out in his and shop a little get bit. 15, 20% off. All right, get cool. There, get you a little drink. All you know right. what I'm saying? It's fine. We got a DJ in there doing his thing. Did so. you see Austin Powers? I did. Austin Powers did. showed up at your pop. I did, I did. You know what I'm I saying? Did. Top shop, Austin Powers, John yes. Baptist. We Let's go. Here. We out here. Thanks for having me, guys. All right, definitely. Go in here and check it out, Plaz. What you think? Yeah, yeah, I think that was very inspirational, and I had a couple of tears. But, you know, we're here to have fun and just check out the store. So stay tuned. And, yo, if you all want to hear more from my boy John the Baptist, go check out his YouTube. Exactly how it's spelled. John the Baptist L.A. And you can find him on YouTube. Really great guy. We're going to go in Top Shop, do a little bit of shopping. Check out. We'll show you all some of the fashions for the listeners and everything. We'll have something for you in the show notes. All right. Stay tuned. Yeah, so I'ma live it up, and I'ma paint the town. Yeah, I'ma have a.